You are the light that illuminates my world. Damn, dude, that's... That's some hobo ingenuity. Uh, she's kind of just running around, screaming, wanting to know where the landlord is. Remember, this person has known that this has been coming for seven months. Yo, whoever's coming in here, whoever's coming in here is just screwing themselves into this bedroom. You don't see that every day. Here's a bailiff right there. We have another bailiff up there. This Escalade uh, right there is actually the tenant who is currently being evicted. You guys hungry for some chicken? Chicken. Oh, look at that. Oh, you don't see that every day. Oh, I won't zoom in. That's how you get murdered. But I bet there's probably a murderer in here right now. As you guys see, we got John Holton. Uh, he looks like he's got a huge saw. So this was open or it was unlocked? It was unlocked. Okay. Hello, hello. We're just here for a walkthrough. Right. Okay, what were you going downstairs? I was listening through the door. Nobody enjoys throwing an entire family's things on the tree lawn, but this is real. This is the type of stuff that happens. Alright, well, let's get the this scary oh, oh, ass so <laughs> <hard. laughs> Hell yeah. Subway, you fresh dog. Action. Told Derek we should have brought the new car, but he said, no, don't put so many miles on the new car. Right now, the tenants are actually uh, grabbing all of their belongings and, and putting them out, trying to pack them up because the bailiffs are scheduled to come at 11.30. Currently right now it's 11.13 in the morning. Now, I know a lot of people are gonna be watching this and I'm expecting some type of hate from those liberal f**ks out there like, what the hell, Holton Wise, you guys are horrible. How could you throw a family out? It's snowing. There's like a little unit above the garage too, but there's, it's like, it's screwed shut. One of them good old stucco houses. I bet they got the Declaration of Independence in there, boys. Kids getting tripped up by the ghouls. All right, boys. So neighbor said there might be squatters. Y'all ready? Yep. Let's roll. Hello, anybody home? Hello. Anybody in here? We're filming on behalf of the owner. I'm gonna come back through recording here. Who's got the light light? Pete. Somebody took the light from me. Holy shit, look at Vincent's light. Your light is bright as fuck. You are the light that illuminates my world. Damn, dude, that's that's some hobo ingenuity. <laughs> Dude, you see the fucking, like, the the whole rig, the baseball bat, and the... Yeah, they got everything. You gotta prop it up enough. It only looks a little spooky. It's only a little bit of mold. Yep. So this was just open, or it was unlocked? It was unlocked. Okay. Hello, hello! We're just here for a walkthrough. We are at April 15th. So this pet tenant has not paid rent. October, November, December, January, February, March, April. That is seven months that this person has been living in this guy's home without paying any rent. I'm not getting ticked, so I'm not going back there, but that's the side door to this down unit. Hell yeah. Free tire, dude. Slow down, asshole. We got connect four. Anything cool in here? 
No, it's a bunch of shit. Dope. Zenith, baby. I bet we plug that in, that bitch probably still fired right up. A lot of times these tenants, they'll change the locks, they'll barricade the doors so the eviction crew can't get in. They seem to think that if they throw away the key when it's eviction day, we won't be able to get in. But uh, as you can see from John bringing a gigantic saw into this property, that's not the case. It don't matter what you do to that door. When it comes time for eviction day, Holton Wise is going to get into that house. So fuck us, that's why. That's all human dust too. You guys hungry for some chicken? Chicken. Oh, look at that. Oh, you don't see that every day. Oh, I won't zoom in. Those are fucking decomposed chicken wings. There's fucking nothing left of them. Oh, we probably should have brought husband. Nope. What is this house? What in the hell? Is this like a rage room? Looks like it. Oh yeah, no, this is where... This is like a canning room. No, this ain't... Huh, yeah, and there's some cans up there too, so... This is where the magic happens. Yeah, this is actually not creepy at all. So that used to probably have a ton of shelves on it. It's like a cold storage. Ooh. That's pretty bowed. Huh. Okay. Well, let's go scare the fuck out of Derek. Let's go scare. Oh, dude, I know. Chicken, Woo! Chicken wing smell? <laughs> yeah, the decomposed chicken wing. That's wings. like a half year old. Yeah, sure. I didn't do this room. This is the only room I haven't done yet. Did you start going upstairs? Yeah, I did all the upstairs. Look at me, shove this sign. Up in here, up in here. It's the only spot that's by the footage. But, or <laughs> by the, by the yeah. house. But, I mean, we gotta be realistic about the area. It's true. Like, for some reason, Dollar Generals are doing really well. Like, there's one right there, dude. There's a bailiff right there. We have another bailiff up there. This Escalade uh, right there is actually the tenant who is currently being evicted. Uh, she's kind of just running around, screaming, wanting to know where the landlord is. Remember, this person has known that this has been coming for seven months. This person has been stealing from the owner of this property for seven months now. And, uh, you know, today is the day. She's got done talking to the bailiff. Looks like she's going to be pulling off now. Looks like it's finally, she's finally come to the realization that uh, she is not going to be able to steal from this landlord anymore. That's, I figured one of the doors around here would be open. You don't see that every day. Is for us to do what? Shall we enter? Oh, you mean it's unlocked? It's unlocked. Oh, okay. Uh, as you're watching the guys take out the final set of this person's belongings, you're seeing all the mattresses, all the beds, everything just lined up on the tree lawn. Again, you might start to feel sad, and you might be thinking, oh, this is horrible. Just passing through. Stop moving. Um, Filming for the owner. Right. Hey, stop moving. Okay, what were you going downstairs? I was listening to the door. My bad. How old was it? Hmm. Nice. And then here's the bathroom. <clears throat> I can't really. The gimbal doesn't like to lean forward much anymore, but that's 
human dust. Whether or not there's a door when we're done with this remains to be seen, but we will be in that property and we will be securing that property for this investor. You guys are starting to stack the tenants' belongings on the side of the house. See a mattress, lamps, you know, just regular, regular stuff. John told me the house was uh, completely filled, so all the tenants' belongings gonna end up stacked on that side of the house right there. Now the way it works here in Cleveland is all of that stuff is gonna be left out there and whatever isn't stolen by scrappers, see a lot of the scrappers, they will follow these bailiff's cars and they will steal all of that stuff. But whatever isn't stolen or retrieved by the tenants by 5 p.m. tonight, this moving crew is gonna drive back to this property. They're gonna grab everything, put it in their trunk, put it in their truck. They're either gonna dispose of it, sell it, you know, whatever they gotta do. Now, I thought I heard water running. I thought there was a leak down there. But the door said the water had. Oh. Um, so he might be in here. No, no that's, that's the basement. truck from this side. Oh, it is? Okay. Well, it's fuck that. Probably you want me to out and... Nah, just keep people out. What is I that? I mean, we didn't even think we were gonna get inside, so. What, the lighter? Yeah, what kind of lighter is that? I never uh, seen a torch torches. like that. That's for smoking crack. Well, this has been a fucking experience. <laughs> well, whatever, we got in. It's yeah. better than uh, the outside footage that we were going to get. Yeah, fair enough. So, uh, who, who's, who's pissing the way? I don't know. Do you like look over there? Murdered. Go over there, fucking, that's how you get murdered. But I bet there's probably a murderer in here right now. Alright, so. We are at the house. We just pulled up to the house. I got my crew out there. That's John. And then we got all the the court appointed movers are all here. Evictions are already a pretty stressful situation, so we do not want to add any stress to this situation. We do not want to bother the crew or get in their way. Uh, so we're going to let these guys do their thing. Sweet, Tommy, protect me if a bullet comes. Damn, that's fucking creepy, dude. Hello? What the hell's that? I have some shit. We're doing a walkthrough for this house. We were told by the neighbor that there's. Potentially squatters in here. Backside splitter got it first. Checking the front. Okay. Oh fuck me, dude. Gotcha. Yo, whoever's coming in here. Whoever's coming in here is just screwing themselves into this bedroom. <laughs> Seriously, look. I mean, probably smart, dude. Maybe there's whoever's breaking in is screwing themselves into the bedroom back there. Really? Yep. And I take it that's the bathroom, so I yeah. guess I won't be pissed. <laughs> I mean, why not? City of Toledo, Department of Utilities. Yeah, I would just piss anywhere in here. Nobody enjoys throwing an entire family's things on the tree lawn. But this is real. This is the type of stuff that happens. If you invest in real estate, eventually this hand will be dealt to you and it's just something that you have to deal with. We gotta get in there, remove the stuff, and move on. That's fucked up. I mean, it's a dick move. Especially since the guy next door was nice enough to let us know that yeah, right. the guy in here would be harmless even if he was in here. Right. Just, just kind of... Damn. The city comes and leaves notices here an awful lot, dude. Yeah, it's fun. Alright, well, let's get the fuck out of this scary ass room. Oh, so <laughs> and she pulls off in her Cadillac Escalade. As you guys see, we got John Holton. Uh, he looks like he's got a huge saw. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.